Welcome back, guys. <clears throat> um, someone, uh, TJ Wolf, I believe, uh, asked about OBS Studio uh, running in Debian. Now, as you can see, I am in Debian and I am running OBS Studio. And I'm going to outline the steps that I took. Now I have two computers and I have Debian installations on both. I basically, let me pull up. I went into the uh, website for OBS manually compiling on Debian based distros. I went through all of these steps and I created a Debian file for OBS Studio, which you can see is right here. So I created this on my other computer using these compiling instructions. Then I copied the uh, file to a disk, brought it to the other computer, installed it, and that's what you see running here. So I now have a Debian file with OBS Studio uh, compiled by me. Now, it works fine, and let, but let me show you, let me tell you what you need to do. Uh, based upon the research that I did, there's, there are a few things you have to have. One is, it helps if you're running a 64-bit installation. I did it on a 64-bit. Two, you need to be running, I believe, at least testing, Debian testing. Now, Debian, well, this, this install, Seduction, is actually testing and, uh, and SID, which is unstable. But I believe if you just have a Debian testing install, uh, you'll be successful. Now, I took all of these um, instructions and I created a little step-by-step -step that I'm going to include in the show notes. And let me see if I can locate that. And that is right here, Debian OBS Studio. Now, there's one other thing. I'm going to copy that to my desktop. But there's one other thing you need to do, and that is you need to have Debian's multimedia um, repository in your sources list. And I'm going to give you the instructions for that also. Uh, so let's take a look. Now you see all these compiling instructions? Well, I have them here, but they're in a little bit easier uh, to follow. And I had a little bit of trouble on the compiling of the FFmpeg. Um, and you may not have to do that. I'm going to put one more step in here because I believe Debian has FFmpeg available. So I put it in as a sudo apt get install. So you've got one to, and when you get to the multiple lines, you're going to copy the entire thing in and then paste it into your terminal. All of these commands are in terminal. So you've got one, two, 
three, four, five, six. Six install steps before you get to, to creating FFmpeg by compiling. Okay, and then once you finish, which is this last sudo check install, once you finish with that, make sure you cd into your home directory before the next step. The last step is actually compiling OBS Studio. And so it, that has one, two, three, four, five, six steps on that. And the FFmpeg has one, two, three, four, looks like only five steps. Let me double check that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so let me let me just see if I have anything missing here. Okay, so we have. Okay, so this see this step here. I have it up top. Okay, I put it up with the installs. Uh, but you can, so that we don't uh, get confused, let me cut that out. And we will paste it in right before. Okay. So now we have one, two, three, four, five, six. So you'll want to add in your Debian multimedia and that's basically one, two, three commands and then adding these two lines to your sources list. Don't bother with what's down here. It, you're, you'll be in testing but don't worry about that. Um, this is just um, for power PC packages and things like that. Um, so, but this this is fine for your testing because uh, Stretch is now testing. So just leave everything right off at here. Okay, so you'll stop right there. And this down here you don't even need. I'm gonna put NA. Okay, so you're gonna concentrate on what's up top. So that's step one is getting your multimedia set up. Step, and then step two would be following this all the way through. Once you get done, you're gonna have that deb file in your home directory. And you'll have OBS Studio already installed. But save that deb file because um, if you need to reinstall on another computer, you'll have the installation. You won't have to go through the compiling. Okay, so guys, uh, that is that is it for this video. Um, it's OBS Studio. As you can see, running fine on my Debian install. And again, this is Seduction, Debian Seduction. I did a video on it. It's a really, it's a really nice Debian testing install. Actually, it's as I said, it's a com kind of a combination of unstable and testing. But it's been stable, you know, solid as a rock for me. I haven't had any issues at all. So guys, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you soon. Take care.